This is an iView presentation. Hi, this is a quick tip showing you how to install add-ons from Blender's repositories. This quick tip was inspired by the article Screencast Keys Add-on is Removed, posted by Blender Nation. Head on to their website for fantastic articles related to Blender. The website is www.blendernation.com. From July the 2nd, 2014, all builds are going to be compiled without the screencast keys add-on for reasons described on this website. To get started, copy and paste this link into your web browser. This will take you to the Blender Wiki extensions page. Once there, you look, come across a website web page such as this. As you can see, Blender lays out most of its add-ons in, into categories. Okay, so the next stage in this tutorial is to head over to the particular add-on you're interested in. In this case, it's the it's under 3D interaction, and the and the Python script is called Screencast Key Status Tool. Head over to this web link, and you'll come across a page that looks like this. What we're interested in is the current version download. There's a confirm. This is the file that we need. It's under file name. And it's called space underscore view 3d underscore screencast underscore keys dot pi and it's version 1.7 and it's and it works since 2.64 and the author or authors are Polo Gomez, Bart Crouch, John E. Herenio, Gaia Clary, um, Pablo Vasquez. A big shout out to these authors. Uh, I'm sure this add-on has been used all over the world and of course just to respect the license it's under GPO. So yeah to download the add-on you'll you can simply click on this and you come across this page with the Python script what you could do is copy it, copy all of this, like so. Minimize your web browser. Create a new document. Call it screencast. Dot pi. The part dot pi is an important ex extension for this type of document and then paste your add-on into the te into the document itself and then you can simply save it alternatively you could hover your mouse over this link right click save link as and then of course you ch select which uh, folder you want to save it in and click save. As you can see I've downloaded it previously. Once you've done that you would need to head over to builder.blender.org to download the latest version of Blender. As you can see here this is the link. Again all the links described in this quick tip 
are laid out in the description below. So head over to builder.blender.org click on download latest builds click on your version of blender wait for the download to finish while that's happening I want to show you how to access it in the current release of blender and when I say current release it's the release that is showcased on the blender.org website so here you can see it's blender 2.71 version 9.3 Three three seven five seven four. So you head over to file, user preferences, add on tab, and you want to type in screen cast. Check the box and exit that, and then press N. And then here you go, you have the start display. Say grab uh, shrink rotate and then a few other settings. Okay, so that's the, that's how it should look look like once you've installed the add-on. Let me show you how to install it. Extract the Blender version you just downloaded. So once you've got your latest and greatest version of Blender downloaded, extracted, or if you're just using it and you've noticed that it's not available in it, what you want to do is go into the Blender 2.7 di one directory. You want to go into the 2.71 folder subfolder and then you want to click on scripts and then you want to click on add-ons and then finally you head over to the screencast.py let's say let's copy over the official one the one with the official title So I'm going to copy that over. Sorry about that. Yep, I'm going to copy that over. Paste. So that's one method of installing an add-on. Let's see if it's been installed first. Then I'll show you the other way from within Blender. So here you have it. You're seen again. You go head over to user preferences, preferences, add-ons, and you type in screencast. Please. So once you come across the add-on, you check the check checkbox, and then you be presented with the option as you would with previous versions. So of course, start display, stop display, start display, uh, icon, text. Right, let's show you the other way. So I'm going to delete that version, delete this folder. Yes. So I'm going to extract it again. So to install it from within Blender, you open the Blender executable, you head over to the file, either preferences, add-ons tab, and then you click on install from file, then you locate it as to where it is on your hard drive. As you can see it's on my desktop so I, it appears there and I click on that and install from far and so you just type in screen cast and as you can see it's there just to and then you do as you would 
with a normal add-on. All links in this video are in the description below. Thank you for watching. Remember to subscribe, like, rate and comment on this video.